We are going to download and install IntelliJ IDE for Java development. Hello, my friends, and welcome to Master Coding channel. If you want to learn coding and start your programming career, you came to the right place. Hit subscribe and like so you help us making new tutorials. Let's begin. In order to download and install IntelliJ IDE for Java, we came first to the to, to Google and we put here IntelliJ, IntelliJ, and we select the jetbrains.com. This is the official site for IntelliJ, and we select on download. There would be two options: it's the ultimate version and the community version. This is for web and enterprise development, and this is for Java and app or uh, sorry and uh, android development it is similar to uh, android studio that we have uh, tutorials on our channel on it so this is for free uh, 30 days trial and this is for free uh, open source so i advise you to download uh, the community and these are the uh, difference between the ultimate version and the community. For now, we are using Java, Kotlin, Groovy, and Scale uh, for free uh, here on uh, IntelliJ uh, community. Also, you can make Android, uh, Maven, uh, Git, and debugger profiling tools. It is not uh, available on the IntelliJ uh, community edition. Java EE, uh, Spring, and these uh, also these specifications are not uh, available so uh, till now i uh, i would download the free community so you can get the file you can get the file it is about 570 megabyte uh, i can also download the ultimate version but I advise you to download the community ultimate version. It is free trial. I would purchase the, the, the license. So I would download it now because we are going to make courses about JavaScript and others. So I need this. You can start download. After you download it, this is the setup for IntelliJ IDE. We click on next. We select the folder and next. It requires 1.5 uh, gigabyte. Uh, I advise you to set, set up it on the, uh, in the C destination. Uh, create desktop shortcut. So the, my uh, computer is 64 bit based. I will uh, add it. You can add open folder in, as project and leave these are blank. Click on install and wait for the process after setup has been finished click on run intellij ide idea and we click on don't import settings because i have uh, installed uh, android studio i'll select the dracula uh, these are the tools you can add them uh, for SQL, uh, for Android, for Swing, for other, and uh, plugin development, uh, application test, version control, JavaScript. Oh, you! It is very important and uh, amazing IDE and very important uh, uh, like uh, program to help you in all your uh, coding uh, languages. Uh, I uh, remember I have installed the ultimate version, not the free version, the community version, because we are going to make uh, on our YouTube channel uh, many courses and on Udemy uh, many courses. So I have installed this for further in purchase of uh, the license. Click on next feature and you can install uh, uh, everything but uh, till now we don't need uh, to uh, to install these uh, plugins start using IntelliJ IDE okay here we came for the activation and evaluate for I will select evaluate for free and I will click on evaluate so this is the IntelliJ uh, IDE uh, 
program that will run our uh, our uh, programs Java programs. So let's create a new project. And let's select, uh, don't select any, anything because it is the Java folder uh, here. Don't select any of Groovy, Kotlin and SQL support because till now we are not making an advanced project. And don't select uh, create project from template. Project name, I, uh, I will name it uh, like test2 and I will click on finish. In this way, we can create the projects in uh, and uh, in uh, IntelliJ programs. The show the tips and close. This is the interface for our uh, IDE for Java IntelliJ. Okay. Next video, we are going to create uh, the first uh, the first uh, Java program that runs and uh, see the output of it. Uh, on our IntelliJ IDE. Thank you guys. See you on next videos.